Do you have one of these guys laying around? Do you know what this is? Ever seen this before? If you did, you would have quick cash. Today I'm going to show you five unique, strange items that sell on eBay. And these items sell super quick. Stay tuned. The first item is actually a couple of items all rolled into one. That's these Black & Decker Space Maker appliances. Black & Decker made these appliances to mount under your cabinet to save space on your counter. They make coffee makers, toasters, food processors, and these can openers. I run into these can openers all the time. This one's not in great condition, but it's still going to sell for $40 plus shipping. Just to tell you how quick they sell, right now there's 60 can openers listed on eBay. 952 have sold. Now this one only sells for 40 or 50 because it's in bad condition, but if you can find one new or open box, you're looking between $150, $200, depending on what model it is. Be on the lookout. Now I'm going to go pick up some onions because we're almost out. So I know when we're not all playing on our Game Boys or sending texts on our flip phones, we're hanging out at home listening to cassettes, right? We've got such a big collection, we don't know what to do with it. Probably not, but apparently some people do. And that brings us to item number two. That's these Napa Valley wooden cassette holders. Now you wanna be sure they're Napa Valley if they got the logo on the side. There's other cassette holders, but these are the best. There's a model that holds 100 cassettes, 64 cassettes, and 36 cassettes. These things sell super quick. Usually pick them up for four or $5 at a thrift store or a yard sale. Right now of the 100 model, there's 55 listed and 142 have sold for between $50 and $75 plus shipping. Not a bad profit, and they sell super quick. Be on the lookout. So our next item is this Medicus double hinge five iron. Uh, basically, you see it's got two hinges and it's not broken. It's supposed to be like that. Basically, it's a golf training aid that when you swing incorrectly, it breaks, letting you know that you're not quite right and you're not quite ready for the masters. I usually pick these up at thrift stores for two or three dollars a piece and they sell for forty dollars plus shipping all day the thing to look out for is these hinges they do get rusty sometimes so you want to make sure it's in good condition and working well like it's supposed to be right now there's 53 listed and 240 have sold so i know it's going to sell quick when i get it listed be on the lookout and the number one rule is once you're done you got to give it some time to let the effect set in you don't want to just jump right up when you're done with it, you want to let it permeate, otherwise... So yeah, that's your next item. It's called a Chi Machine. That I know of, there's two brands of these. One's Jiggling George, and the other one is the Clark Exerciser 2000. Right now, there's five Jiggling Georges listed on eBay, and 30 have sold. They'll go for an average around $60, $65 plus shipping. The last one I bought, I paid $7 for, and it sold within a week. These are unique items, so they're easy to spot in the thrift store, and they're really easy to test. These things sell quick and for good money. Be on the lookout. So our last item is a mind blower. This is a A-Light Designs Mayfly chair. It's an ultra lightweight camping chair. And honestly, it, it's small. My kids had it and she almost couldn't fit. It's, I don't know who's sitting in these, but this chair sold for $175. I picked it up at a Goodwill for $4.94. You can see that in my last video. And it sold within 12 hours for $1.75. Right now, there's only three of these chairs listed and they're solid color. And 17 have sold in the last 30 days. So these things sell quick. And it's actually going overseas, so I have no idea what they paid for shipping. This is a great bolo. If you see these, grab them. They sell quick. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm headed to my storage unit to get this chair shipped out along with a few other things. Comment down below, let me know what you think. Let me know what kind of content you'd like to see and we'll see you on the next one.